what type of winds are required to do something like this? So the first thing I'm going to look at on this tree is, um, was it uh, older, was it diseased, was it hollowed? Because it takes a lower wind speed to do that. The other thing I'm going to do is I'm going to look, is it a softwood or a hardwood? It takes more wind to uproot a hardwood tree than a softwood. From that point up until up in, into here, we have debris spread. So that gives me a good indication of maybe how wide the tornado was. Even though it didn't take down all of these trees, there was wind speed strong enough to the break as part of the tornado funnel itself. And, um, and so that would be give us its width. So I'll come to about right here and then um, collect the other point. And we will have an edge to the um, an edge to the tornado. Okay, that's it.